This video will show and explain the installation of the Igniter Kits 1281 and 91281 into a stock Ford distributor. In the box, you will find a module attached to an aluminum plate, a black plastic ring called a magnet sleeve which contains eight magnets, a hardware kit, and an instruction sheet. The tools you will need are a flat blade screwdriver, needle nose pliers, acetone or another cleaning fluid, and an emery cloth or a piece of Scotch-Brite material. This installation does not require you remove the distributor, but it never hurts to remove and inspect it. First remove the cap. Inspect the inside of the cap for wear or excessive carbon deposits. Then pull off the rotor and inspect it. Next remove the points and condenser. The points are removed by simply removing the two screws. Next there is a wire attached to the condenser. Remove the screw and remove all the wires. You will also need to remove the black wire from the negative side of the coil. Then pull through the distributor housing. Remove the grommet. Inspect and clean the points plate using acetone and emery cloth if necessary. The points plate serves as a ground and it's very important that it is clean. Now it's time to install the kit. Place the module plate in the same position the points were. It is critical that you reattach the ground wire. Using the screw provided in the hardware kit, secure the module plate and the ground wire. You do not need to tighten it this time. Pull the red and black wires through the distributor housing and place the grommet in the distributor. Now place the magnet sleeve onto the points cam. Just position it correctly and press down until the unit hits the bottom. The magnet ring should be level with the top of the black module. It's time to set the air gap using the clear plastic tool found in the hardware kit. Place it between the module and the magnet sleeve. Push the module towards the magnet sleeve until there is no gap and tighten the screw to hold it in place. Now place the rotor and cap back in position.